Let's learn how to add words on a photo. For example, suppose you want to put the words on a photo of the front of a computer. So first you'd need to find a photo, so you'd either need to take a photo, or perhaps there is a website where you can find a photo, like for an assignment of some sort. Here's an example. This is a computer diagram assignment. And simply by clicking on this link here, front, a photo will appear of the front of a computer. When you are putting notes on a computer photo, you always want the highest resolution photo as possible. So if you're using Dropbox, for example, make sure to go to the direct download and open that direct download before you do anything else. That will give you a very high quality picture, the highest quality available. Hold your finger on that and save the image to your device. By going into your photos, you should be able to find that photo. And in iOS, there's a way to edit photos, which is at the top right. You just tap on Edit. Then, if you look along the right-hand side, there's several controls. There is a brightness, auto brightness, or auto color correct. There is a cropping tool. There is a color selection, auto color selection. There is also a little control for changing it to black and white, or changing the color, or the lightness or darkness. What we're looking at is this little command here which is called More, and underneath it there's something called Markup. It's going to look like a little pen. Go ahead and tap on that, and the screen should look something like this. So let's add a text label underneath this power button on this computer. So first you're going to want to zoom in as much as you can, and your device might not let you zoom in too much, but zoom in as much as you can. Now you might think that you could just use one of the pens or markers here, but that's not the best choice. Underneath the plus sign, there is a text box choice, and if you press text, the text box will appear in the middle of your slide. Now clearly you're not going to want the text to be black if you're on top of black background because it's going to be extremely difficult to read. And if you're expecting people to be able to see it, they might not be able to see it and might think you did not label the picture at all. So make sure you choose a color out of the several choices at the bottom for something that would look good on whatever background you have. Now to change the text, double tap, and you can type exactly what you want to be on the label. You can try resizing the label and placing it exactly where you want it to be. Sometimes you might want to put it near if the spot is too small. For example, putting this right here would be okay. Or even down here if we changed it to black. To change the size, there should be a small a double a and you should be able to change the size. But as you notice, if you do that, it might be too large. So you want just the right size and the right color so it looks good where you're going to put it. I think down here would actually look the best in this case. But some people might say, no, just right here is good. I'm going to make that size just a tad smaller. So go ahead and try yourself. You could do one more. We could do one more together. Um, for example, let's see if we can put this in the middle and then, whoa, let's touch undo. up here. 
I think I'll just name this optical drive. Now when you're all done and you have everything labeled you want, press done and then you'll press done a second time. And then depending on what you're doing with this, you can of course share it or you can email it or upload it to whatever place it needs to go.